What is up guys? Thank you and welcome back to the channel, Living in the Inland Empire. Uh, if you're new here, uh, we go through everything I eat, living, playing, breathing, eating, um, lots of homes. Uh, today we are here at Alta Season in McSweeney Farms out in Hemet, California. Uh, this is a new build master plan community. We're gonna be touring, I believe, three homes today. But first, if you have any questions about living in the Inland Empire, moving out here, uh, what have you, I am a full-time real estate out here. Uh, all my contact information is below. I do have people reaching out pretty consistently, which is awesome. Thank you guys for that. Uh, you can call me, text me, email me anytime, but let's rock, let's roll, let's rock and roll and check out these new build homes. All right, this first one we're gonna get into is the Pearl model. This is about 2,300 square feet. It's a three bedroom, two and a half bath. Now let me flip it around so you guys can see it. Like I said, three bedroom, two and a half bath with a loft and a study. And again, this is Mick Sweeney Farms over in Hemet. This is a new build master plan community. The specific builder here is Richmond American. My experience there, very competitive with rates, pricing, whatnot. And these homes already do include quite a few upgrades in the pricing. This little kitchen. Your living room or den. So that would be the garage there. Storage. And like I said, this is the Pearl model. You have a downstairs bedroom. And the downstairs bathroom. Looks pretty spacious. You got the shower there. There's a nice big entryway coming into the home. Nice big loft study area for the kids. Put a water around with a ton of storage for the child. All right, so we got one bedroom downstairs, two upstairs, plus the loft. This would be your master. One cool thing. The old master plan community. There's a huge park area over there. And the clubhouse is massive. I don't have any video of that yet. So the master bath. And your walk-in closet. Nice little vanity. bedroom number three and I don't think they're counting downstairs as a bedroom because there's a bonus bedroom so we got three up and one down pretty cool must be like the kids or I guess bedroom bathroom these homes do come with quite a few upgrades So here we go. This again, this is the Pearl model. Three bedroom with the optional fourth. 2,300 square feet. With the loft, I'll get everything locked up. We'll head to the next one. 
All right, this next model behind me, this is called the Tourmaline. This is also a four bedroom with a loft, three car garage. And it starts at 534. I'll get it flipped around so you guys can take a look inside. Here we go. Pretty nice house. Like I said, Tourmaline, this is over in McSweeney Farms. Richmond American build. This specific model is a four bedroom with a loft. And a little bit bigger than the last one at 2,600 square feet. That is a nice wide entryway. Some people like them small and just non-existent. Other people like to have kind of a grand entrance. This one I would say has more of a grand entrance style. Again, this is the tourmaline model. I hope I'm saying that right. It's got a downstairs bedroom and bathroom. This one has really tall ceilings, big open windows. Downstairs bathroom. <laughs> Garage is locked. We'll head upstairs. Nice big loft area. And here we go into the master bedroom or primary, whichever you prefer. So the rest of the bedrooms. This was a four bedroom. You got one downstairs for real this time. These bedrooms are actually really big. This is bedroom number three. Eventually that will all be full of homes. And bedroom number four. Both rooms have kind of this little cutout like where the window is. Right, add some storage at some point or make it like a little reading nook or homework corner. Another big laundry room. Wash basins are nice. And kids are coming in the bathroom. So again, this is the tourmaline model. 2,600 square feet, four bedrooms with a loft. Also a three-car garage. And at this point in history, this one is starting at 534000 Let me uh, get everything shut up. And we will head over to the next one. All right, this next one is the Ammo Light. This is their bigger one. This one's a little over 3,000 square feet. It's a five-bedroom. I'll get you turned around here in a sec. Okay, like I said, the Ammo Light model. Five bedroom plus a flex room starting at 570, about 3,000 square feet. 
And these are the Richmond American homes. And McSweeney Farms out here in Hammett, California. Let's start in the kitchen and we kind of get through all these other rooms. This is the that is a ton of space, ton of storage. You have this like little chef's kitchen area with more storage, more counter space, and a nice big walk in pantry. Love the way they decorate the Be like bonus office, formal dining, and you got your downstairs bedroom, which is probably a lot larger than most bedrooms in general. Jesus, and then a full bathroom. Nice big loft, right walking, right when you walk up to the top, looks great. And this would be the master bedroom, primary bedroom. Very nice. Big old closet, almost also like an extra bedroom. And here's two bedrooms with kind of its own bathroom off to the side. Very nice. Then we walk out. This would be bedroom number five. This one is a little bit smaller than the other ones. But that's okay. And you got some more storage at the end of the hall. And a nice big laundry room here. So, alright, this again, this one was the ammo light model, 3040 square feet. Five bedroom with kind of a flex room and a loft. And this one is starting at 570. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed today's tour. Again, this was Alta at McSweeney Farms over in Hemet, California. The builder here was Richmond American. Tax rate over in this area is 1.16, but there are some special assessments. If you have questions on those, go ahead and shoot me a DM, uh, text me, call me, email me, whichever. I would love to talk to you about it. And you can feel free to reach out at any time. Uh, my number and information is all below. Um, I do try and post videos weekly, so don't forget to hit the subscribe button with the notification bell. That way you can be alerted as soon as I, as soon as I upload a video. Also, if there's anything you wanna see out this way, or any questions you have, uh, feel free to shoot me a message. I would love to cover it. I'm always looking for new ideas on what to cover in this area. I just need to know what people are interested in. Anyways, again, thank you for tuning in and I'll catch you guys on the next one.